Hello and welcome back to Garen River vs. Shadows of Doubt. I am the Detective Moose Brain, and I am back on the case of the brief case case. And I've had an idea. If I go through the city directory, I know the person's name is Molly. So if I search for every M who lives in Gomez House, it could be M. Oh, no, that's me. Turns out there are five M's who live in Gomez House that I do not already know. So, as my mother always said, when breaking into houses, start at the top and work your way down. It's better for the legs. So we're heading up to the prestigious floor 15, the very top of the building. There's somebody in. Hello. What's your name? Of course, why would you tell me? Can I come in and take a look around? Got any spare change? Well, have a terrible day. Ooh, peek underneath. I think she's still stood there. I'm not certain, but I think those are her feet. I'm getting very low on lockpicks. Is she awake? Wow. Wow. What's this? A cola? Don't mind if I do. Work road to Miriam. This is not the right place. Next up, floor 11. Ah! Oh yes, I remember this floor. The definitely not a murderer lived there. Which means I've partially broken into here already. Oh, it's reset. And I'm out of lockpicks. Damn. Luckily, lockpicks aren't too expensive. I can buy them in bulk. Well, hello again. That's fair. Anybody home? Probably not. Ah, a gun. That's a good sign. Mia Crespo. You are not the right person either. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Why'd you have a gun? Why do you have a gun? And why why we why was it raining indoors just then? Uh hello. Yes, you are losing your mind. Random person with a gun. What's your name? Layla Gonzalez. No, it's nothing to me at all. I always walk around brandishing a gun at strangers who are just breaking into random houses. Why would I not? Work rotor? Hazel Barber. Not helpful. Min Jun Kim. Wrong house again. Good day. I didn't mean to knock on that door. Damn. Uh, hello. Uh, what's your name? Well, that would be too easy. Ah, yes. There's the Lars Victim's house down there. Better not get spotted by that police officer. He's already shot me once. Molly Wheeler. Gotcha, Molly. Ah, Molly Wheeler's purse. That's uh, good to have, just in case. So there's a second person in this house. I heard them over that way. Her work rotor, 9 to 5, Monday to Friday. That'll make it easier. I found a good place to hide. In her closet. There's nothing weird, I'm on an investigation. I was planning on waiting it out, but then I realised that would be terribly boring. I found her files. If I can find her passcode, I can get into her safe, which is probably keeping the envelope. She's up. I guess I'm staying in the wardrobe. Maybe I should have stayed in the closet. Ooh, the light's on. Whoops. If I had a crow for every time I was hiding in a woman's wardrobe waiting for her to go to work, I'd only have one crow. This has never happened to me before. I don't particularly like it. Did she just go back to sleep? She's got work in two hours. Note to self, the next time this comes up, and I'm sure it will, 
wait until they're at work, and then break in. It's more comfortable waiting in your favorite cafe. And they have more cola. She's back up. Tell me, you don't need the wardrobe. Bad news, I'm out of cola. I think that was the front door. Oh no. It was not the front door. Where am I? I think it's time to get back to work. Ah, perfect. Her passcode. The secret envelope. Toxicology report. Ah, Paxadol. I'm familiar with it. I took it the other day. Brilliant. It's incredibly toxic. Well, they may kill me now that I've read this, but I will not tell them that I've read this. I'll just, uh, I'll leave her a present and I'll, I'll take this. Now to get out. A flawless escape. No one saw a thing and no one's the wiser. I'm glad to finally be able to put this case behind me. It has been a trial and a half, to say the least. I'm supposed to leave this near the snack machine. I, I assume it is the vending machine. Yes, job done, letter securely delivered. 8267921. Case complete. And no one killed me for reading it. Bonus. Hey now, no need for that kind of language. Oh. Well. I, I thought the door would hold it. Damn. Now to get a few hours of well-deserved rest. Ah. Hmm. Why was I thinking that you could just eat raw meat? Now I don't feel well. This is what I get for buying fresh produce. Ugh. Okay, I feel better now. Right, now to get some real food. Well, that was stupid of me. But at least it landed in the fridge. So there's that. Got a bit of an overhaul now, the shower's fixed, I've got somewhere to apparently cook food. I don't understand the concept, but I'm making a life for myself. Ooh. Moment I lay down for a rest, there's another murder. That shows me how to sleep. Wait, what? Stubbs Deluxe, I'm on my way. Stubbs Deluxe, I have arrived. Uh. Hello. Noting you two as people who've been hanging around. Ah, here come the coppers. 103, right through here. Ah. Oh yeah, this is where that ritual murder happened last time. Literally next door. Hang on, I spoke to this person. They were rude to me. I don't want to say they deserved this, so I'm not going to say it. Ooh. Well, seems the police are getting a bit anxious. You're a credit to the force, officer. Now ah, there's a footprint underneath the mat. Probably that officer that just broke in, but just in case. And a fingerprint on the mat. Probably mine, as I literally just moved it. Oh, is it my turn? Yep, they're done. Fingerprint. And another. And another. And another footprint. Although that one again could be me. Hello, have you seen anything unusual? Wish I could help, but now I haven't. 
Well, that was very nice of you. Uh, do you have any change? Yeah, sure, anything to help. Thank you very much. Good luck. I think I'm getting some allies. Dooby dooby doo. And then I'm inside. Why do they always write things in places where they cannot be read? Forever. And I'm going to assume that... Oh, is that the corpse inside the cupboard? It totally is. Um, someone appears to have drawn something lewd on the floor. Normal six again. I will admit it is hard to examine the corpse while she is stuffed into a hiding place. I will get into the hiding place with her. All the better to examine the cadaver. That did not work. Annika Sharma. Almost certainly the victim. Hmm, there were yellow splashes of that other crime scene as well. That was a poisoning. Maybe this is the same thing. Trisha Mand. Ah, she could be the victim instead. Ah, synth beef. Maybe that's what poisoned her. Junk, junk. Beer and junk. Wow, this is a very full bin of trash. Work ID. She works at Dragon Burger. Another bin with trash, beer, beer, and more junk. Have these people never heard of recycling? Is that why they were poisoned? Found a load of information, but... Ah, count up from five. Five, six, seven, eight. Damn, not her safe. More junk and beer. What is with these people? I'm just gonna put this chair in here. Just in case I need to reach that. Open that in case I need to escape the police. Five, six, seven, eight. All right, I'm, I'm still not certain who the victim is. And to think, Trisha was only 10 months from retirement. I smell from going through all of that rubbish, so I'm just going to take a quick shower. I'm sure no one here will mind. What kind of person doesn't have a towel? AD. AF as a fingerprint on the work rotor. AF and AD seem to be everywhere, so it is almost certain that they are the two people who lived here. And as AF is the one on the safe, the safe for which I do not have the code, that is probably Annika. Well, it's a shame that I can't reach her inside that hiding place, but I guess I'm going to have to just assume it's fine. Ah, AE on the lipstick. That and the boot size 11 are the best shot I have at finding the killer. Because if she was poisoned, it probably came from that lipstick. Not a lot to go of, just a footprint and a fingerprint. The first thing would be to determine who the victim was by finding out which of them is still alive. No one seems to be here, so I'll just help myself around a bit. Confirmation that Trisha is AD. A key. The key for the building. And a lipstick. With Shibay's print on it. Code for the office is 4823. That's handy. Well, Trisha was here just before closing. But who knows where she is now? She might even be dead upstairs. It's very inconvenient that I don't know. <laughs> Nothing useful in the safe. Well, that didn't answer anything, so... Ah! She works at my favorite diner. I always knew I'd have to break in here at some point. It was inevitable. 0510. 0510. Into the security room. Yet another unwanted matchup on V Love. What is with that app? It seems Annika didn't come into work today. Further implying that she is, in fact, the one who was murdered. Maybe I can follow the boot prints. Ah. Yeah, it, it seems the boot prints were, in fact, the police. Probably not the killer. Well, that leaves me in a bind. Still unsure who the victim was, and with only a single fingerprint to lead my way, I'm out of options. Ah, the key for the Dragon Burger. Well, I'm a trusted customer after all. There, AF. Glad that is confirmed. Further implying that Annika was the victim. I've now cleared all of their colleagues, none of them match the fingerprint. And... 
back into the building. You didn't see it. You didn't see it. Ah, also Annika's purse is here. I, uh, I appear to have missed that the first time. With a bit of blank crumpled paper. Two bits of blank crumpled paper. How odd. Aha! Something E forever. An Annika. Annika E forever. Annika E forever. Star E? Hmm. It's still very strange the way that they insist on writing things across multiple rooms. Annika Star E forever. Hmm. Enzo. Enzo is in their address book. I saw him around the time of the murder, and his name starts with E. He's just jumped to the top of my priority list. Aha! I can check their handwriting. Annika has a much larger, bolder handwriting type than Trisha does. Trisha's is this, but Annika's is this. Ewan. It's also Elnor. Ella, why does she have so many friends with E names? One question remains. Where is Trisha if Annika is a... What? Oh, damn! She's still following me. Just replace my cola. Doubt she's still on my trail. Anyway, as I was saying, where is Trisha if Annika is dead and their entire apartment is blocked off? Come to the door! It's only 9 p.m. Are you Ewan? Here. Ewan O'Connor. Good to meet you. Do you know Annika? Uh, yes. Loves coffee, good to know. Saw them a Dragon Burger. That was two days ago. Can you provide your fingerprints? Appreciated. That has all but eliminated him as a suspect. Have a good night, sir. I saw some people in here. You don't happen to be Trisha, do you? No. No, you do not. Seems Enzo isn't in. Also seems he's the neighbour. That's how I knew him. Good evening, Eleanor. Yes, I, I have seen you around before, apparently. Can I get your fingerprints for an investigation? Uh, can I come in and take a look around? What about for a hundred? You seem quite aggressive, Eleanor. Only a stranger asking to come into your place at ten o'clock at night. What's weird about that? Just checking. Oh, would you look at that key? Well, I'm going to leave that right where it was, shut the door, and then leave patiently. Well, um, that is not what I expected when I knocked on this door. Uh, could I speak to uh, Elia, please? Uh, any chance I can come in and look around, although obviously this is a bad time. F for 50. Appreciated. Um, okay. Hello. Elia Ambroise. I don't know why you turned the light off. I'm clearly doing something. Thank you. And Shirag Khan. Would you please stop turning the light off? I'm busy. Come on now. Elia Ambroise.
clearly you're just going to continually be antagonistic, Elio, and I do not appreciate it. Fingerprint AP. Hey, wake up. Would you provide your fingerprints for an investigation? No? What about you, Elia? Good of you, Elia. I appreciate it. I'm glad we can put our antagonism behind us. Don't you dare turn that light off, I swear. AQ. Alright, while he's out of the room, cough, cough, take key. I mean, he's eliminated as a suspect, so I'm just going to leave them be. Can I help you? I'm resisting the urge to throw this at you. I hope you know that. Be on your way. Ah. With the suspect pool reduced to Eleanor and Enzo, it's time to get creative. Ah. Hello. Thank you for turning the light on. Makes it easier to see you. Also, to get a lay of the land. AR. Yeah, it seems she's most likely AR. That lets her more or less off the hook. Just to be sure. A quick trip into the indigo hair. Into the employee database. AR. Confirmed. Pagano's. Enzo, good to see you. Would you give me your fingerprints? No. I tried the nice way. Ah, the kitchen seems quite busy. I'll uh, hang around a bit. Uh, health inspector, I need to survey your premises. Yes, the, the health inspector. So, I need a guest pass. Oh, well, here's the money for a guest pass. Thanks, friend. I need to check your kitchen. Yes, I'm a health inspector. Chemistry set. Unusual thing to have in a kitchen. Ah, perfect. Wonderful. I'll just come in here and shut the door. 7065. Perfect. Employee database. I'm allowed on the computer. I have a guest pass. I mean, I, while I appreciate uh, the uh, the intent, uh, no thank you. I'm just going to have a look at this. A.E. Enzo has just been tied to the crime. Evidently, he was in love with Annika. This was an open and shut case. Enzo. No, this is not Pagano's Enzo. It is time for justice. You were in love with your neighbor. Living across the hall with her girlfriend and or wife, and you, you, you longed for her. So instead of winning her heart the way you always dreamed, you went in and you poisoned her lipstick. And for that, Enzo, you shall be punished. Why are you shooting me? He's under arrest. He's a criminal. Okay. This seems excessive. You must be an accomplice. Stay out. Uh, someone is shooting the health inspector. Stop shooting me. Stop shoot. Stop shooting me. Oh, what is going on now? This is not a good situation. Um, oh, somebody is dead there. Uh, I had this investigation. Oh, goody, they're wielding knives. Um, there is a way out. If I can get into the cubicle. If I can get into the cubicle. I need to get into the cubicle, please. It's very important I get into the cubicle so that I can get into the vent and crawl for my damn life. 
Oh. Well, that did not go according to plan. I'd better seek medical attention. Luckily, there is a sink clinic right next door. Oh, hell. Ooh. That was close. Oh. I will be honest, I did... Ooh. Feeling a bit numb now. I did not know that arresting somebody would get me shot. That was unexpected. I wish I could do with a little bit more pain killing, if I'm honest. Ooh. Still feeling a bit bruised. And I'm back to normal. Right, Enzo. Ah, good, I'm glad the police is here. Uh, these people pulled a gun on me. Here was me, arresting a murderer. Who is still here. Um, I'm going to... Yes. Uh, yep. Poison. Conformation. Enzo, I'm arresting you under suspicion of murder. So you're gonna do anything about it? Yes, I'm arresting you under suspicion of murder. Pay, uh, do pay attention. Do you have any spare change? A uh, bit of a long shot. The murderer was Enzo Arroyo. I found his fingerprints at the scene. He lives at... I've forgotten where you live, Enzo. Is it 101 or 102? No, you're not going to be helpful, are you? It is 101. See, Enzo, the directory is more helpful than you, and it doesn't even get me shot. Enzo lives at 101, and the murder weapon is the poison. Consider yourself arrested. Someone will be along shortly. Now stay here, don't move. Don't touch anything, and don't get me shot again. Don't know how many times I have to stress that. No matter how much you do for this city, there are always people who choose the tri- There's not even anyone here. Who choose their tribes over justice. But you know me, I have no tribes. One of the waitstaff at my favorite diner was murdered, and I cracked it in the night. Apparently murder- uh, the- oh, the lipstick was the murder weapon, not the poison. That's surprising. Sure, um, okay. Well, case closed. Social credit level up. And another beautiful case cracked by Moose Brain. So, thank you very much for watching. I feel I redeemed myself a bit in this one. And uh, I'll be back with more soon. Subscribe for more Shadows of Doubt. Check out the other cases. And I will catch you later.